It's funky. I feel summer vibes. Oh, kiss me. We're gonna do another throwback and have you guess some songs from the 90s. Oh, great. I'm just not cultured, I'm sorry. I think I'll do good at some parts and then just some parts I'll be completely clueless. I'm gonna do such a bad job again. The music I only listen to if it came out like yesterday or a couple months ago. Okay, depending on genre, cause I'm not good at 90s rock and sometimes non 90s like bubblegum pop. I don't think I'm gonna do that well. I only listen to songs that are out now and that are good now and then after that, it's like I'll just push them back and then I'm kind of ready for like the next wave of music. I used to listen to 90s music all the time when I was younger. I haven't really been listening to it as much lately so I might be a little rusty. I know a good amount of 90s stuff. I listen to a lot of like 90s rock but I also remember a lot of like the pop music that they played. I'm ready. <gasps> I know the song. I okay. Wait, oh my god. I've heard this in so many movies. Jump around. Jump jump up and get down. Jump, jump. I feel like this is a, a still this is still a really popular song. I know that for sure. This is always just a really lit song at a party. Do you know it? I don't. I don't know this song. The song title is Jump Around, but I don't know the artist. The title is Jump Around, but I don't know the artist. Jump Around by Ice Cube. It's Jump Around, but I don't know who it's by. Ever since I was five, I've been dancing to the song. I love this song. This is Jump Around by House of Pain. Yeah, see, I don't know who House of Pain is. I've never heard of them. I don't know if maybe this was like their one hit wonder. This song is a super popular and commonly used party anthem. It was featured in the Robin Williams film, Mrs. Doubtfire, as well as several other films like Rush Hour, Happy Gilmore, Black Hawk Down, War Dogs, and Bridget Jones' Baby. Wow, it's a lot of movies. All right, yeah, I definitely heard it in Rush Hour. That's definitely where I recognize it from. Like, I've heard them play it, like, in movies and stuff, like, as montages. As soon as I heard it, I attached it more to, like, movies that I've heard it in. I for sure heard it in, like, Mrs. Doubtfire and a couple of those other ones. on my playlist, like, early high school. I feel like I've heard this song in like, 10 Things I Hate About You. It's a good song, I love it. Okay, I was imagining like, flowers falling from the sky for some reason, but it's cute. Do you know this one? No, I don't know this song. Kiss Me, but I don't know who it's by. Kiss Me by a known artist. The title is Kiss Me, and I do not know the artist. This is Kiss Me by Sixpence None the Richer. Never heard of them before. What? I've never heard of them. That's ridiculous. Come on, who's gonna remember that? These names back then were a little weird. Like, they need to shorten them down or make them more catchy. See, I know this because Joey Badass sampled a piece of this. Ooh, and then the like guitar in the background. Ooh, yes. I've heard this song too. What the heck? Okay. I know this song. Yeah, no, the song. It's weird. It's like has a weird vibe to it. It's like it's Mexican and it just kind of feels like Latina, but then it's like the voice kind of throws you off. Do you know it? No. No, I don't know it. I don't know it. I have no idea, title or artist. This is Smooth by Santana featuring Rob Thomas. Never heard of that. I've heard of Santana, but probably not Rob Thomas. <gasps> Rob Thomas! Oh my god, wait, hold on. That's why it sounded so familiar. I actually used to listen to him. 90s is such good music and a bunch of hits, but I just can't pinpoint any of them exactly because it's just a little far off from me. Yeah, yeah, God is good. This is 
is like some gospel music. I feel the country vibe right away. Is this a Christian rock song, I'm guessing? This is so like something I would hear in church or something. Okay. Yeah, country music or like gospel music is definitely a no-go for me. My brain just tells me no and just shuts it off. Do you know it? I don't know it. I don't know it. Never heard the song. If God was one of us. If God was one of us, but I don't know the artist. This is What If God Was One of Us by Joan Osborne. Joan. Who? Yeah, I've definitely heard of the song What If God Was One of Us, but this is my first time actually listening to it. Wait, like Osborne as in like, oh God, what was what was his name? Who's saying Crazy Train? Different Osborne? I don't know the artist, that it sounds just not familiar. Destination unknown as we're pulling for some gas. Officially placed the poster, reveals a smile from the past. I feel summer vibes. Yeah, this is definitely not chill. This is kind of weird. I don't like it. This reminds me of Cake in a weird way. The band Cake. I'm so, like, gone right now. It's like over my head. It sounds like a parody song, like how the Barbie girl song was. That's what it sounds like to me. Do you know this one? No, I have no idea. I don't know the song. How Bizarre, I don't know the artist. This is How Bizarre by OMC. Oh, who's OMC? I've never heard of OMC ever in my life. All right, that makes sense. The song is kind of bizarre. I know I've heard parts of that song. It didn't really ring a bell. I'm gonna remember that. How Bizarre by OMC, I'm gonna remember that, cause I like that. Unfortunately, the lead singer of OMC, Polly Fuimana, is remembered only as a one-hit wonder. That must be why I don't know who they are. <laughs> Things you notice about the 90s is a lot of the artists are one-hit wonders. Well, that sucks that it's like, oh, you couldn't do anything after that, but at least they had one good song. Song. Give me one reason to steer. It's funky. And I'll turn her back around. The voice sounds familiar. But I don't want to leave you alone. You got to make me change my mind. I don't think I've ever heard this song before, but like I need it more in my life. Like it sounded really good. How about this one? Do you know it? Nope. I don't know this song. I have no idea. No, I don't know it. It's Give Me One Reason by Tracy Chapman. This is Give Me One Reason by Tracy Chapman. Oh, shoot. I haven't heard of her. I know Tracy Chapman from my uncles. They always tell me to listen to their music. This is definitely one I'm going to look back on, but like, how did I not know this artist before this very moment? My mom has always been a huge fan of Tracy Chapman. I think when I was around four, that was when she would play Tracy Chapman in the car all the time. Okay, there we go. But who's the artist? Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah. I would serenade a girl with this song, yes. This is like something my dad would listen to. He's really into that. from like 90s romance movies like this song just like right at the climax i love it last one do you know it no i don't i don't know it high above me i don't know the artist it's called high above me but i have no idea who it's by she's so high but i have no idea who it's by she's so high but the artist no idea this is she's so high by tall bachman i've never heard that name before okay i feel like i've heard of that song before but the artist again just Nothing. Never heard of them at all. I liked it though. Like these, I kind of want to listen to 90s music more now. Bachman once stated in an interview that the inspiration for this song came from trying to set up a beautiful girl with his stepbrother. Well, that's kind of awkward. I feel like that never really works out, so. But at least he got a good song out of it. So he tried to set up a girl with his stepbrother. Do they say how it went out? That's an interesting story. I love how artists kind of talk about where their lyrics originated because that really makes you listen to them more.
Thank you for watching Do They Know It on the React channel. Subscribe for new shows almost every day. Hit that like button if you like this episode. Hey 90s nerds, Alyssa here, a producer from the React channel. Go ahead and let us know in the comments what your favorite 90s song is, hit subscribe, and jump around!